Hey, welcome to Digipro Tips, I'm Andy Edmondson and I know it's been a little while since I've been here but I have got an amazing, amazing time saver for you today. You are going to love it. How would you like it if you could hit a button and everything from now on is auto-captioned for you? No writing it out, no putting captions on manually, changing them all about however you need it, it does it automatically. That's right, I've got it for you. We're gonna save time, we're gonna work smarter and not harder. We're going to auto-caption our videos in Premiere with Descript. Let's do it. All right, so this video is pretty much what it says on the tin. We are going to save a bunch of time by auto-captioning our videos. Now, in the way that I work, in the way that many people work, and definitely on social media these days, you will see every single video in your feed that has burnt in captions. Uh, YouTube doesn't really do that at the moment. You have CC options um, that you can turn on and off, um, but definitely for other social media platforms, captions are burnt in as a standard. Now that definitely means that either you or one of your team or you're outsourcing it to someone else, but someone is writing those in manually. There isn't, I can't think of a technology right now that can do it for you inside of Premiere. And technically this isn't inside of Premiere either, but it is incredibly simple to do, and it's gonna save you so much time. I'm talking about using an app called Descript. They've been around for a few years, and their software essentially listens to any piece of audio that you give it, and that can be a video now as well, and it transcribes that for you and gives you the option to manually change that. You can edit text, you can edit the audio and the video within the text by simply getting rid of words and it'll change the video for you. Um, but what it also does is it creates an SRT file for us. Now I'll get onto that in a minute. Let's dive in and I'll show you how we're gonna do this, okay? So the first thing that we need to do is we need to go to Descript and we need to download the Descript app. Now the free version of Descript gives you three hours of free transcribing. But for just $10 a month, and this isn't an ad for Descript by the way, this is just incredible. We're not being paid by Descript to make this video at all. But as a note, for $10 a month, you can get unlimited transcription through Descript, which if you make a lot of video, that is incredibly cheap for the amount of time this is gonna give you back. We're gonna download the free version of Descript, we're gonna install it, and then we're gonna make an account with Descript so that we can use it. Okay, so we've got Descript open, and what we need to do is we need to tell it what video we want transcribing so that it can make the captions for us. Now that does mean that you have to have your video already exported from Premiere in, for it to, to work, but you can also just export a WAV really quickly uh, or an MP3 even, and it will take it as long as the video is gonna be exactly the same duration as what you're gonna send Descript now. Because otherwise, if you end up changing a bunch of things, then your captions are gonna be in the wrong place. So finish your edit, send it to Descript, then you can add your captions on top. Don't mess about with it after that. So I'm just going to click new project here. I'm just gonna find a video for one of our older projects. Uh, let's go for the multi-camera sequence. If you haven't seen that, link up there. That's gonna add the file. So that has added the file now to Descript and it gives me an, op an option here. You can have multiple speakers to be identified by Descript, but obviously it's just me speaking. So I'm not gonna choose that option. I'm just gonna choose automatic and then hit transcribe. That's gonna send the audio uh, from this video through the Descript uh, application. It's gonna use its algorithm to pick out all of the words uh, from that video and transcribe it for me. So as you can see now, it's going through and transcribing about 25% here. Um, it shouldn't take too long once it started that process. Okay, just finishing up 100% and bam, there it is. There is the transcription of my seven minute long video on a multi-camera sequence setup in Premiere Pro. Now then, 
you can scroll here and it will take you through every single bit of this video um, showing you the words as they appear. Um, you can also go to the different sections here by just clicking in the text. But what we actually want to do is we want to go to the correcting text and then what you need to do is you need to go through meticulously as if you were going through any of your videos and checking for grammar, spelling, uh, punctuation, and just making sure that it's exactly correct. Um, now I'm not going to do that just for the purpose of this video because I want to show you how to get it into Premiere, but you definitely need to make sure that you have got your text correct here because this is the quickest method to do it and um, before you go into Premiere because then it gets a bit fiddly when you're messing around with the caption settings in Premiere. So what we've got now is we've got like pretty much an hour's worth of work easily for anyone that is quick at captioning, an hour's worth of work here, already transcribed, ready to go into Premiere. So how do we get it out of Descript? Well, it's very, very simple. All we need to do is we need to go to this export button and we're gonna to go to export subtitles and captions. Don't use the timeline export here for uh, Premiere and Final Cut. Um, you actually just want to use this subtitles and captions because we're going to use the .srt file that it will make for us. Now I want a maximum characters per line of 25 and then two lines per card. Export. So that's it. We're kind of done with Descript now. So we're going to jump into Premiere and then we're just it's going to take literally seconds to bring this in and have our fully captioned up video done. Okay, so now that we're in Premiere, the only thing we need to do is set up this once to accept our captions and have them where we want them. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to go to Window and go to the Captions uh, panel. I'm going to Import Settings. So this is for any SRT files that you bring in. These are the settings it's gonna apply every single time. You only need to do this once though. Once you've done this, every time you bring this, cap, this SRT file in, it's already done. This is where you save the time, as well as Descript, obviously. So I'm gonna hit OK on this. And then, literally all I need to do is grab this SRT file, bring it over the top of my timeline, and there we have it. I've got my captions inside of Premiere without having to do anything. I haven't typed a single thing. It's done it all for me. That is incredible. That is so much time saved. Like technology, blowing my mind right now. But for you, this is huge because you don't have to outsource this. You don't have to pay people to transcribe videos for you and you don't have to or do it yourself even. You're saving so much time and money by using this. And as I said earlier, $10 a month for free unlimited transcribing through Descript to bring it then into Premiere to have your captions already transcribed for you is incredible. So you know what to do because this video definitely helped you. You need to hit that subscribe button. You need to like this video or write a comment because we work smarter here, not harder. And there's gonna be more like this, but I won't leave it so long next time. We'll see you in the next video.